Time for our top three. I will start, Andy. Fisher is my number three. They pick up their first win on January 7th. For that alone, I'm giving it to them. SHG, number two. They are very impressive. And Lincoln, number one, going on the road and beating Muhammad. I'm going to go with Dylan Ginnelick, getting 17 points, helping Monticello to their 15th win. Warrensburg, Lathan, of course, holding St. Teresa. A great game there. And Charleston getting that big clap win in the class. Rivalry wins are always nice. Illinois offensive coordinator Tony Peterson officially out after one season tonight. Brett Bielema releases a 7 o'clock statement. We always love those, Andy, <laughs> saying that Peterson has been fired. Bielema said after evaluating the season, he decided to make the transition to a new OC. He thanked Peterson for his work. The Illini were 11th in the Big Ten in scoring offense last year, dead last in passing offense. All right, some history in the making last night. For the first time in more than a decade, Illinois basketball is 4-0 to start Big Ten play after a 12 point win over Maryland. The most important the important thing of the night, though, was Io Dusimu unveiling his jersey lifted to the rafters. The first name going up at the State Farm Center since 2008. It was very emotional. You know, I was trying to keep myself straight, you know, smile through it all. Um, I had a nice shirt on. I wasn't trying to mess it up. So um, I was just excited, though, you know, to, to really just know that no matter what, you know, my my um, cousins, you know, friends, whoever come to Illinois, my son or um, my daughter, whatever, my kids, 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 whenever they look up there, they go to see my name up there. That's something that's, that's, um, that's crazy. So you the 34th player in program history to have his name in the Raptors. If you missed any of the coverage from last night, head to our website right now, WCIA.com. For Andy, I'm Brett. Thanks so much for watching Full Court Friday. We'll do it again next week. History in the making. Thanks for watching.